Polar vortex, schmolar vortex. At least that's what anybody would say who lived for the great Arctic outbreak of 1899. I'm meteorologist Jason Myers, and even after more than 100 years, this mid-February Arctic outbreak still stands as the coldest the United States has ever felt. Temperatures fell below zero degrees Fahrenheit across every state in the Union, which, by the way, every state in the Union in 1899 was all of them except for these five. It was already frigid cold across the entire country in early February when an extremely cold air mass drove south from Saskatchewan, Canada. The west coast felt the chill first before it spread out across the rest of the country. Twelve all-time state record low temperatures were broken as the mercury just kept falling. Four of those records still stand today. During this epic cold spell, at least 100 people died, livestock was lost, and plants and trees didn't live to see the spring. But it wasn't all bad. Many were able to prepare thanks to the advanced warnings provided by the Weather Bureau. Farmers saw improved soil conditions because of freezing and thawing and fewer bugs eating their crops. And finally, there was a record number of babies born that Thanksgiving. You do the math and figure that one out on your own. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this, and down below in the comments, let me know what you would have done during the Great Arctic Outbreak in 1899.